Okay, hi guys, my name is Pascaline Alex Ijoma, aka Cordelia, aka Mbaza Queen Tablet. You know what it is? Anyway, Cordelia is a single mother in Jennifer's diary, and Jennifer helped her so much. And um, she's a calm friend, let's say, but it's just that I won't say she's promiscuous, she's not promiscuous, but um, you know how life can be. Oh, twingy, twingy, twingy. But anyways, Cordelia is a very calm character and the character is, is cool, yeah. Well, I was acting when I was in school, university, then I just did a movie and I wasn't interested. Like everything is just so somehow, somehow to me. So I have to just stop and finish my schooling then I started all over in um, 2012 professionally yeah my first movie was like a so I didn't even see my face in the film so I just turned my back and the camera just passed me <laughs> that was my first movie so people when you are sharing the movie on African magic nobody will know it's me because they didn't even show my face it was my back only me know that I was in the movie <laughs> <laughs> but the movie that made people to notice me was um, college girls that we did in Ghana produced by Uchi Bonabo. yeah so everybody watched college girls and to God be the glory I started getting jobs and roles and all that Challenges. Well, I don't think there are no challenges if you ask me. I think the more the more you are coming up, the more you say things and all that. So there are no challenges at all. Acting has opened some doors for me and it's still going to open. Yeah, it makes you get recognized, like people that don't normally talk to you will just be like, hi girl, watch your movies, and you're like, oh god, thank you. And then it makes so many things, like things you want to do, people, when you go to an office, people will be like, oh, she's an actress, and you know, you get going and all that. So it has opened so many doors for me. Jeez. Yes, I do. Very well. Hmm. If I was not acting, I'll be a businesswoman or a musician. <gasps> I try my best. I used to be a chorister when I was a child, like when I was seven, eight, nine, ten years. Yeah, I used to be a chorister. Okay. If I tell you, say I love you, my body, your body, no. I, you. I don't know how to sing that song, but I'm trying. <laughs> I know how to do the re. If I saw la ti do, do ti la so for me right now. <laughs> my stage name. My stage name will be PK. Okay, my full name is Pascaline, but when I was when I started in the industry, people that don't know how to, some people call me Pashaline, some people call me Pasqualine, some people call me all sorts of names. So one of my friend Jerry and he comes like, oh, I told him my name is Pascaline. He was like, oh okay, PK. And I said, well, it's supposed to be like PC because, or PS, or whatever she said. He was like, no, PK. And the moment they started calling me that in the industry, everybody started calling me PK, 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 PK. So I love the name, and it's PKAY. Yeah. Mm, awesome. Wonderful. Lovely. That woman is a darling. <laughs> 
here. <laughs> she's a sweetheart. She's a heart of gold. Like, oh, Uncle Kindele, I love you, mom. <laughs> okay, in a movie, yes, I was a lesbian in college girls. I can do any role. Depending on how the nude is, because there are some movies you watch, somebody is naked, but because of the storyline, because of the way the whole thing is, you won't be seeing the nudity in the movie. What you will be seeing is the storyline. So after all, Angelina Jolie is a go nude. So as an actor, you can do anything. depending on the amount and it has to be a very like a high budget movie um yes i'm working on a new project and um well when is due i'll let you guys know What keeps me going is God and me being me, me being real to myself and all that and where I'm coming from, my background. I have a little friends in the industry, two very close friends in the industry. Then I have people I respect so much that I love because they are my colleagues. Yeah, so I have people I love so much in the industry and I respect them so much. But I just have two people that I can call my friends, like they know my in and outs in the industry. Names withheld. Well, it depends on people, yeah. Me, what I call friendship. If I call you my friend, that shows I know you too well and you know me too well. I can equally, maybe when I'm not okay, I'll call you up and be like, girl, um, this is happening to me right now and you can advise me. You understand? That's what I call friendship because there is different between, there is different between um, acquaintance and friendship. So I think the industry, there are some people that are still very true to themselves when it comes to friendship. But for me, me and my friends, we are true to ourselves because we understand we understand how it is and what goes on in our life and we talk to each other, encourage each other and all that. So I just know me, I don't know about people. I'm not married, I'm single and ready to mingle. And this is um this thing is just a fancy ring. <laughs> If I find love, dear now, it's okay. If I not find love, mm -hmm. I can marry a man that has potentials, even if he don't have much right now. But like, you have a future. I can't. I don't think I can marry. Eh, I don't think I can marry a man that more successful. Ah, me, let me tell you the truth. Me, I love. My man to be in control. I don't want to be the woman that controls her man. You know when a woman has money, some women have money. They, you know, it enters our head. So I wouldn't want to be more successful than my husband. I should be successful in my own calling and he should be also successful in his own calling so that I won't come up on there and tell him, baby, please, can you help me wash plates? I love men that are controlling like, I got you. Mm, my skin, I don't bleach. My skin, you can see here, you can see no knuckles, you can see my neck. So my skin, I love my skin so much. Like me, if you ask me, I'll tell you, I want somebody like Anthony Joshua, Christian Ronaldo, blah, but it's a dream. Anyway, I like my man tall. I love my man tall. I love, um, he can be dark, he can be 
but I don't I don't like fair guys. If you want to be fair, be a Yibo. I like dark chocolate um kind of my color, not fair, 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 fair. Yeah, and I love a very hard working man, prayerful man, and a man that can take care of me and love me so well. Yes, you can, you can, it's possible you can just tell your man, okay, I don't want to have sex before marriage, and if he agrees, but it's, it's, it's a good thing, somehow, somehow, I don't know, I'm not married, so I wouldn't know, but I'd like to know what's up before I enter the marriage. I don't want a marriage I'll go into and I'll be like, whoa, well, no. Nah. Yes, very, 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 very soon. Yep. I'm walking towards it. I'll be... I'll be a hibiscus flower. If... I'll be a hyena. That's the animal I want to be. Like, when I want to kill somebody, I'll first of all... Don't mind me, I'm named Modra though, but I love hyena, cheetah, so I like to be one of those if I'm an animal. <laughs> All the people I've worked with in the industry, I want to work with them again. Yako, Funka Kindele, Angela Okore, Matilda Baseki. Uche Obodo, Uche Lendu, Kenneth Okoli, Auntie M.M. Mimi Song. Um, so many of them. Chine Yana, Kalisto Kronko, Messi Majo. So many. Oh, if I can't remember your name, you know I love you so much. I want to work with you again. Hey Charlie, I've not worked with RMD. I want to work with RMD. I want to work with Genevieve Naji. I want to work with um there is this guy that was on road to yesterday with Genevieve. I don't know his name. I want to work with him. The lead actor. I want to work with him. And I want to work with um Done. And I want to work with Pete Doce. No, I can't. Uh, my boyfriend, my boyfriend can come here once I've called. It's still doctor that he's wasting. But un unless the person is outside the country. If you're outside the country, don't call me with WhatsApp call because they have free Wi-Fi there. Yes. Don't call me on WhatsApp call. But I hate the WhatsApp call that I don't even know you or I've not spoken to you like in two years because you got my number, you start dialing my number, start calling me on WhatsApp call. Charlie, what happened to phone? As in normal phone call. No, if, it's, if, if my boyfriend is outside the country, please, Charlie, call me on normal call. You can't be calling me with free WhatsApp this thing. But if you are in Nigeria, we know you are spending money. Data is money now. So it's not everything has its way. Five things that make me a good actress, or uh, that make both good actors, your your eyes, your mood, your speech modulation, your attitude, the way you carry the character. Um, your emotions and the way I can interpret the character so so well. That works. That's what makes you a good actor. If they give me a script, I go through it. I try to learn the character that I'm playing. I need to put myself in that character and I'll just pull it off. Like one movie I did one time, 
I have to play very raw scale and all that. When I finish doing the movie, because I did very good, when people call me and tell me, oh, I'm watching your movie, you, you acted as a, um, a conductor, blah, uh, you know, a pack girl, Agberu and all that, I'll be like, because yeah, when I reach, I read this, the, the script, when I reached um, at the park in Inu, where we were acting, I was looking at all the alayes, all the Agberu there, how they behave, how they talk and all that. When I get to my hotel, I'll try to look at my mirror and talk. Ah, let's up all those things then. So that's how I do. Career goals. Um, I set a goal for myself. Like I want to go far in this industry, and I want to not just Nigeria. I want to go international. I know and I want to use it to um, do some certain things for my people, my country, Nigeria and all that. So that is the goals I've set for myself for now. Maybe I'll still add more. Maybe I'll not add that I want to be president of Nigeria. Okay. Who uh, uh, we'll go to all the houses that you go in now? The people that have bands, all those things, houses, everything, collect the papers, everything, sell the whole thing, we move, go back to America. Uh, uh. <laughs> because what? I don't understand. What will me and Bubu be doing just two of us in Nigeria? Uh, uh. We'll just sell everything in Nigeria now, change our country name to Niger, move to another place. It won't be here again. Okay. Mm. Okay, that's the butterfly. Before I used to have, um, what would I call it? I used to feel insecure about myself. And one day someone told me, oh, you're so beautiful. I was like, wow. And the person was like, and the way you carry yourself because you know you're beautiful i was like no i don't know i'm beautiful and people don't use them my father don't use them in my father's self you don't even send yourself so i just felt the way the person said and it's a chinese man that told me the way he was like oh you look like a butterfly i was like and i asked him okay what's like well he now said a butterfly is a beautiful bird um incense and he knows it's beautiful then it spreads the distant world and all that so i was like okay later after that i have to just get the tattoo and before i draw anything on my body but this is the first and last i will not drawing anything on my skin again pride means pride and beauty yeah i know i'm beautiful and i'm proud of myself so that is the meaning of my tattoo My fans and people that don't know me too well, please, I'm a Nigerian, I'm an Igbo girl, I'm an Anambarian. And secondly, please, 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 don't be seeing the character I play in movies to be me. Naturally, I'm a calm and, you know, I love smiling, please, you should stop looking at me like, I'm Razo, I'm this, I'm that. Please, I beg you. My characters in movies are different from me in real life. Uh, I think it's when I beat up my sister when she was small and she fainted. <laughs> yeah, so I regret it. Uh, I have so many happiest moments. My happiest moment is... My happiest moment is always when I go on the road and people call me Cordelia. <laughs> I don't know, I have so many happiest moments. I can't remember. My greatest fear is not to be successful. 
I'm scared of that shit, man. Yeah, I'm scared of it. I want to be successful, like, you don't understand. I don't know about that. I don't know, I don't know. I can't say anything, no. So nobody prays to be a single mother. So I can't actually say I, I want to be a, I want my, my, my children to grow, grow into father and mother, this thing, but I don't know, I can't say because everybody has their their fights and their struggles. But single motherhood is not easy. Kudos to all the single mothers, seriously, it's not easy. Okay, because they packaged baby mama. See, single mother, baby mama, all of them are the same thing. There is nothing like single mother, baby mama. All of them are mama. Mm. <laughs> I guess, okay, maybe let's say baby mamas are, uh, people they call baby mamas are people that got pregnant for celebrities, Abby. Then single mothers are the ones that normal businessmen and women. See, single mother or baby mama, all of them are mother, mother. So, there is no difference between single mother and baby mama. I love writing, I love cleaning. I have um, a cleaning company now, we clean. Yeah, so I do clean offices, houses, and all that. Just not, not me doing it though, I have workers. So if I'm not acting, I love money. I love money, like when I see money, I'm happy. So I work so hard. I love doing businesses that relate with money. So money makes me happy. Yes, not only acting, but acting is my first love and keep being my first love. I've tried, Abby. They said for you, how much are you going to pay me? This one I'm doing now, is it not acting? Like seriously. <laughs> you could just on oh, Broadway TV, you could just be collecting all the Ocean 3 acting from me. <laughs> Money, Broadway TV. <laughs> this one is acting now. Mm -hmm. Hi guys, my name is Pascaline Alex, aka Cordelia. Keep watching Broadway TV, Entertainment and Lifestyle Television. You'll love it. Bye, catch you later.